Hey guys, good morning, happy Sunday. It's me. <laughs> yes guys, it's Sunday, it's about 10 a.m. and I'm home. Yes, I'm home on a Sunday because I was out all weekends. Um, I went to a women's conference. One of my friends, um, she has like this nonprofit organization where she um, encourages women. So I was in New Jersey um, hanging out with them at the conference. I got the chance to take pictures. People asked me for business cards and it was just such an amazing time, like an amazing time. The conference was about purpose and um, you know, reaching destiny and staying the course basically. And it was so amazing and exciting. I got the chance to take pictures and just communicate with people that I probably would not have like if I did not go, you know? It was amazing. And let me show you something. So she just wrote her first book, guys, her first book. I'm gonna have her information down below. But this book is called 30 Days on This Journey, a devotional for women on the road to destiny. Yes, her new book. And guess who helped her to take pictures for this new book? Me! <laughs> I cannot believe like she, she trusted me to take her pictures for her first book. And look how it came out. It looks really great. She added some edits to it and it looks wonderful. I'm so proud of her. For years, she's been doing conferences and every time she does it, it just gets even better. Like God continues to bless her meetings. People come out healed and delivered and just refreshed. So she finally decided, well, not finally because, you know, low key she was writing a book. She didn't want nobody to know. So she finally released it and it's just great. It's, it's awesome to be a part of someone else's journey to help someone else um and to 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 see her grow in such a way like i just met her a few years ago but we have connected and i've seen her grow and it's so encouraging to me so yeah guys that's what i was doing this weekend i was in new jersey and even though it was only in new jersey like it felt like a, a nice vacation like even if it was for one day overnight really it was a nice vacation i got the chance to get out of new york the hustle and bustle all of that stuff to be able to enjoy myself in a different state with other women and um see new things like you know it was awesome it's awesome connecting with people and hearing their stories and being able to pray for them and stuff like that so yeah i'm home i'm home i just decided you know what so much has happened over the weekend and so many like encouraging words has been spoken to me and over me uh, yesterday that i just want to stay home and kind of take it all in and just yeah take it all in you know and process it all and you know i know that god wants to do something different in my life um, as far as like my gifts and talents that he's given me uh, especially with this camera thing right here um, so I just wanted to stay home take it all in refocus think about the things that I heard this weekend I took some time to read her devotional and I'm gonna be doing that over the next 30 days reading her devotional in the mornings um, yeah and clean up this place because I left and even though the place is not dirty, it needs cleaning. And I, I like I like it to be clean. So I'm gonna just take some time, clean up a bit, and you know, enjoy my space and peace and quiet. Yes. So um, yeah, guys, how are you doing? I know uh, it's been a while since I came to you with this camera. And like I said in the last video, I'm actually uploading it right now, my hair video. Um, I did not have my camera battery and my video editor was acting silly so it was just a whole lot but still I wanted to make sure to get you guys some material that material was from my phone I hope you enjoyed it you know um, but kind of like a hair vlog type thing you know just chill not really a hair video but a hair vlog you guys can come with me and see how I get things done you know in reality so yeah um, yeah so that's what I'm gonna do today clean um mentally prepare for the week ahead which is going to be a wonderful week yay 
so many changes are happening but it's all good it's really good stuff like I'm excited and I know God has a purpose and a plan in this season yeah <laughs> so many great things are happening um let's see so yeah that's what I plan on doing today I do want to go out and get some fresh air you know but one thing that I do need to do and I you know it was brought to my attention that I need to work out because <laughs> I, I breathe I don't know if you guys uh, notice I don't know if y'all even noticed that closely as this individual did <laughs> but um, I breathe a little heavy sometimes so I want to work on finding an exercise that can work out my core you know my heart and stuff and um, I did find something on YouTube I think I might try it today hey that might be fun um, it's like an abs workout uh, type thing so I'm wondering, I hope it, you know, I can do it here in my apartment. I was always wondering, okay, how would, the, would that seem like working out in my apartment? I hope I'm not going to make noise for people downstairs and stuff. I don't have carpet. Um, hey, maybe I can use that foam. <laughs> you guys remember this foam? I still have it, actually. This foam is still here. <laughs> and it's actually supposed to be for my dogs. I have it there blocking the kitchen because I don't want the dogs to go in there. But maybe I can cut it and use it as a yoga mat. <laughs> use it as a, a yoga mat for now um, to bring like, you know, give like a barrier so that when I exercise on the floor, I'm not making a lot of noise on the wooden floor. Um, yeah, but I do plan on getting a rug in here this season. Don't mind the floor, I need to clean it up a bit. But I wanna get some stuff in here. My plans for this room, right? This room, next month in October, I want to get the couch that I, you know, you guys came with me to Bob's Furniture and saw it. I want to get that couch. I want to get that couch. I need a couch in here, especially when the, you know, the weather gets colder. I want something comfortable that I could just lay out and watch TV or have people over and they can just lay out and you know, we can hang out and just be. It's just this lonely old chair and you know, this chair needs companionship. So I wanna get that couch so that I have not stopped thinking about that couch. Actually, I really want a sectional, but I don't know if that will work out in this apartment. Oh, I want a sectional so that when I have people over, we could just lay out on the couch, like lay out just comfortably. I was told that this TV is kind of small. You know, eventually I wanna get a bigger TV. It's not much of a problem to me because it's just me. But um, yeah, those are my plans. I'm kind of rambling right now. Yeah, <laughs> but I'm gonna get up and get started on some cleaning. I'm uploading the video right now. Let's see where it is right now. Uh, okay, wow, this is slow. So that should be up by the afternoon. But in the meantime, I'm gonna get up, clean up, get started on my day. As you can see, I'm so happy and excited, as I always am. And the sun is out. That just makes my excitement even more excited. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys, rambling much. See you guys soon. Hey guys, so the time is uh, the time is 3.17 and 80% of my place is clean so I already cleaned up and everything. I found a workout on YouTube that I'm going to try so of course I'm already dressed for my workout. Um, I don't exactly have workout clothes but I tried to find what I had and this is what I came up with. So. I have these Adidas, uh, they, they were pants, they were kind of high water pants. So what I did was I cut them at the knee and then I rolled these up so that you don't see the crazy cut. So yeah, my Adidas pants. And I don't exactly have a top with the same fabric. So I wore this um, 
under things so I don't because I don't have any sports bras so I wore this um, and then I wore this thing too so might have to roll it up a bit just so that I can get some air um, all right so oh yeah and I'm gonna put my hair up now I hope that my retwist doesn't mess up because of this this little workout just have to see you know okay so let's get this thing started um where's the remote control right here don't laugh at me guys it's been a long while the only time i actually exercise is when i do dance and that has been a few months ago so i'm just gonna roll this thing up here i'm gonna roll this up and get started you guys might be thinking, why is she working out? She is so skinny, she doesn't need to lose weight. I'm working out so that I could stay fit because I was told <laughs> by someone recently that I breathe hard and I have to say that's very true. I do breathe hard, I do get out of breath when I run up the steps. So I wanna be healthy from the inside and you know, strengthen my heart and, and all those things. So. You don't have to be, you know, oversized, overweight to be out of shape. You could be skinny and out of shape too. <laughs> so I need to get in shape. And this is why I'm doing this in-home workout. Um, I might, after this, take a walk around the block and then come back and take a shower. But yeah, I'm not doing anything else, so I might as well experiment a little bit with this. So here goes nothing. Jessica here, fitness model from Miami. Today we're going to do an uh, under 10 minute ab workout that you can do right at home. We're just going to go through each workout for a minute. So I'm, I have my phone with my timer, so just follow me. We're going to start with a push up to plank. So you're going to just start in your push up position. Make sure you keep your abs tight. And then you're just going to go down to plank and right back up. Okay, so we're going to do this for a minute. So get ready to start. Make sure you lift your butt off the, off the floor. 
setting my time for a minute, and let's start. Oh my goodness, what in the world? Oh my gosh, I can't lift my foot off the floor. <laughs> I think I'm gonna try that abs workout maybe every night before I take a shower. But right now, I wanna do something fun. So I'm gonna do a Zumba fitness workout that I found online, 52 minutes. Let's see. working out for like maybe 20 minutes and <laughs> hey everyone's got to start somewhere so I guess um, right now I'm just gonna go in the shower <laughs> I'm not gonna take no walk around the block I am sweaty and nasty but hey I feel alive I feel awake which is a good thing Woo, for progress even though it's just the first day you guys, I give it up to you. If you work out either every day, every other day, once a week, once a month, I give it up to you because I need to work on my stamina. I'm like, I'm pretty much, I'm like later people. If I was in a class, I'd probably be like, you know what? Peace out, guys. I'll see y'all. See y'all when I see y'all. But that felt great. Now I'm going to jump in the shower, make something to eat for dinner, maybe meal plan for the week so that I'm not in the kitchen every week. I can't even hold up this camera very well. But guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for spending Saturday with me, Sunday with me. I need to go get some water. I'll check y'all next. Vlog Z. Or, uh, subscribe if you're not subscribed. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Later!